Hi everyone. In this video, I will teach you how to create a modern typographic poster design in Photoshop. The artboard size is 1920 by 1080. Go to the adjustment layer and click on solid color. I am using this orange color for the background. Then, add a blank layer. And select the light orange color. Go to the brush tool and use these settings for the brush. Then paint it like this. You can play with the opacity to get the desired result. And our background is ready. Then go to the type tool and type the text. Change its color to white. Make sure all letters are capital. And font to Nagasaki. Open the character panel. If it's not there, bring it from the window menu. And add a bit of spacing between the letters. Open the layer panel and press Ctrl plus J for the layer via copy of it. Right click on it and choose Convert to Smart Object. Press Ctrl plus T, right click on it and choose Flip Vertical. And drag it down. Right click again and choose perspective. And follow me. Add a layer mask to it and go to the gradient tool. Make sure the foreground color is black and apply it like this. Then go to the filter menu, blur and Gaussian blur. Use these blur settings. Now select the text layer and add a blank layer. Right click on it and choose create clipping mask. And apply the orange color using the brush tool. Bring down its opacity to around 30%. Press Ctrl plus T and adjust it. Next, select the Type tool and type the other texts. Follow me in that process. Then I have this barcode, drag and place it here.
Now it's time to add the image to the design. Go to the file menu, place embedded, select the image and click on place. Bring it top in the layer panel. Then go to the select menu and subject. Here I need some manual selection, I am using the lesso tool for it, so hold the shift button to add the selection. Press Ctrl plus J for layer via copy. And hide the original image. Select the image and adjust it. Press Ctrl plus J again. Select the first image and right click on it to open the blending option. Add the black overlay color to it. Press Ctrl plus T and adjust its size and position. Add a layer mask to it. Go to the gradient tool and follow me. Add the Gaussian blur to it. and bring down its opacity a bit. Press Ctrl plus J. Change the overlay color on it. Finally, select and place this effect. Bring it top in the layers. Change its blend mode to color burn. Drag and place the icons in the design. And that's it. Share your thoughts on this. If there is any question, you can ask in the comment section. Thank you for watching.